exactly 10 years ago, we were right in the same spot debuting Iron Man 1. And I was extremely excited because we finished it, because we actually delivered and made a movie for the first time with Iron Man 1. The notion that in 10 years, we would be on film number 19, having introduced so many of the iconic characters beyond my wildest dreams into the MCU and now culminating in a film like Infinity War, it's, uh, it's overwhelming and I, and I actually still can't believe it. I mean, I 10 years ago never could have imagined the scope of this. It's so enormous and, you know, I think it's just to be able to stand kind of, you know, side by side with my fellow Avengers and, and feel like I've, you know, I feel pretty kind of grounded, I've, um, you know, in, in this experience. I've been fortunate enough to play this character, you know, for a long time and, you know, be able to really celebrate her, her journey and, and take it with her and, and it feels good. Yes, well that, so it's a weirdly exciting event in the sense that we're all a bit nervous about our contribution uh, as actors generally are, but at the same time, I can speak for myself when I say this, you know, you're a small little tiny square on a massive mosaic, so you can, there's a lot of other people's brilliant work to enjoy, so I'm, I'm really excited to see it. So I have no idea how they did that and, and actually did it without giving anybody the full script. So. <laughs> <laughs> and we're here, we even have nobody seen the movie. I don't know how the Russo brothers, who lets them, who lets them get away with this? I can't wait to see, I hope it's good. I haven't seen anything. Am I in it? You can tell me. It's such a testament to the story making that brings us together as humanity instead of tearing us apart. These are good stories. It's very exciting to be, to be a part of a history um, that I think is going to be around for a while and will be remembered fondly. And I think to be a part of half of that time about, um, I feel really, feel really lucky to still be here and to still be written into the scripts and the stories. Uh, I really love getting to work on these movies. I really love working with the cast. I really love getting to work with the crew. Um, and I love my character, so it's it's been a thrill. It's been a lot been of secrets. Yeah, we, yeah. We've been hiding secrets for years on this movie. This is a very interesting night. We finally get to share it with people and then talk about it. But it's been hard because the past several weeks we've been traveling the world, promoting the movie, talking to press, and we but we haven't shown the movie, which is a very unusual thing. So finally, tonight, and within the next couple days, most of the world is going to be able to see it. So it's pretty amazing. It is extraordinary, and it has been a source of constant surprise to me that that these movies are, are so warmly embraced by so many people everywhere in the world. I have not found a pocket of the planet where people don't know who Loki is. Um, if you find one, let me know. <laughs> um. No matter what country you go to, there are people who know these characters, and, and it's, it's so imperative to understand the, the, the plights of each of these characters and the desires of each of these characters, the inner workings of each of these characters when you watch a movie like this because you can't sit there and explain to an audience who all these people are. You, you kind of need to know going in and for the most part the world knows and so uh, it's amazing. It's a testament to the fans. And that's Marvel just being genius at what they do and being able to craft everything, every film up to this point so you're, you're going to get that final final hit but no pun intended or anything but everybody who was involved in these films and this experience everyone who wrote the comic books for the previous 50 60 years it's all kind of led to to, to this moment uh, for a lot of us and and to be a part of it in any shape or form is is, is a blessing um, I gotta say there's a real nostalgic kind of vibe going on I feel and, and emotional more than any other film or premiere I've been to um, because, you know, this could possibly be the last time we ever do this. And, uh, I mean, who knows, or it may not be. You go into comic book stores and you start asking questions and all that, and there's, it's like PhDs in comic book characters and Marvel characters, and it's kind of fascinating. I mean, these people, like, lived this stuff. 
And I was a comic book guy, but not as much as some of the people that I've met. So you really do, when you're doing it, you feel like not only you're doing it as a job or for the studio, you feel like you're doing it for the fans. And I've never experienced that before. That's pretty great. I just want to see it so bad. I just want to see it so bad. I want to get in there, see the film, and it's going to, I just, I can't wait. I'm so excited. I just, I just can't wait. Ladies and gentlemen, the cast of Avengers Infinity War.